Good morning, Lottie. You look upset. Is something wrong? Oh, it's nothing, really. This brush is supposed to change colours with my mood, but it's not working. You mean the enchantment failed? That's right, but it's probably just a prank. Someone switched it out with a normal brush. I wonder if anything else isn't working. Not good. And if it's happening here, that means... You see? It's not working. Neither is Lottie's brush. And there are other things, too. Which means it's all my fault. Calm down. Whatever is going on, it's not your fault. No, but it's spreading. Almost like a virus. That is weird. I didn't think a golden snitch could get sick. Don't be silly. Of course it can't. It's not a living thing. But something is causing enchantments to fail. And it all started with me. Everyone's going to hate me when they find out. Maybe someone is trying to make it look like it's your fault. Got any enemies? Maybe the phrase, but then Mr. Ferrell said whatever corrupted the brooms was very sophisticated. Which definitely rules out Colby and Fisher. I did hear that someone from the Ministry might be coming to look into it. Uh, I doubt the Ministry is going to send someone just to check out a few faulty brooms, even if they are cursed. Quite an entrance, Harry. Don't tell me you flew all the way from London. Apparated just south of Hogsmeade. But I couldn't pass up the chance to fly over the castle. It's good to see you, Neville. Students, I want to introduce you to a friend of mine from my school days. This is Harry Potter. I, I won't stand as for all who fight against evil. Spelliarmus. 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 A pug no. Firecrab Incendio Essence of Disney Stupefy A Pugno Stupefy Incendio no. I won't stand aside for all who fight against me. Harry's here to look into your broomstick incident. But nothing official, mind you. Just out of curiosity. If it's sure. Anything I can do to help. Great. I'll see you later then. Ask him for 
help if anyone knows about flying under pressure, it's Harry Potter. Be sure to ask him about disillusionment charms and cursed brooms and dementors too. It would be great to get some advice from Harry Potter. But that means I'll have to fly in front of Harry Potter. I can be better at this. I should be better. I just need to keep practicing. Right. I'm not going to... Why is this so difficult? Because you're trying too hard. Mr. Potter! Please, call me Harry. Alright, Harry. <laughs> um, what did you mean, exactly? Because it feels like the harder I try, the worse I become. <laughs> and why do you think that is? Because... because I'm never going to get better, am I? I'm all Not at all. You're quite good, in fact. Or you would be, if you'd stop getting in your own way. Look at it this way. Your broom wants to fly. All you have to do is let it. If you try too hard to control it, if you overthink it, you're not letting the broom do what it was made for. I doubt it. A curse like that requires constant eye contact, and that was only one broom. No, I don't think a curse is your problem. Your problem is that you're distracted. Let's try again. Go on, mount up. Now, let everything go. Your fears, your worries, classwork, everything. Focus only on the broom beneath you and the sky above. Let the rest of the world fade away. Now, flop.
Paul win the game with an outstanding performance. They are really unstoppable.